for you. The search for survivors suspended after a plane crashes into the Columbia River in Astoria. Today, we're learning more about the pilot, a well-known Clark County leader. Welcome to a special edition of Coin 6 News. I'm Dan Tilkin. Former Clark County Commissioner John McKibben was flying a friend from Vancouver to help her scatter her husband's ashes. Yesterday afternoon, witnesses saw his plane crash into the Columbia River near Pier 39. Tonight, Amy Frazier has more from Astoria. This is John in the airplane. This is how friends say 69-year-old John McKibben would want to be remembered. This is a text message that I received from John just uh, two days before. The text message says Saturday fun and shows McKibben having some fun with the plane he and his friend George Welsh rebuilt. He's probably flown it, um, I'm guessing, five, 600 hours since we had the rebuild done. So it's, a, it's a trusty airplane. Yeah. It's a very tough airplane. McKibben was in the 1941 North American AT-6, commonly called the Texan, when he and a friend flew out of Pearson Field in Vancouver Wednesday afternoon. He had a good friend on the airfield that died, well, I guess about a year ago now, but uh, his wife had asked John to, if she could go up with him to scatter his ashes over the ocean. And that was the trip. At about 3.50 on Wednesday, people in Astoria started calling 911, saying a plane had gone down in the Columbia River. It was flying around and then it took a nosedive. So we're a little mystified right now. Obviously, at this point, we don't know if there was a mechanical failure or uh, we just don't know why. This happened. McKibben is a former Clark County commissioner. He was also a Washington state lawmaker and a school teacher. He leaves behind a wife and two daughters. To Welsh, the tragedy is a reminder to live life to the fullest. And John did. He did more than most by far. In Astoria, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 News.